Hi and welcome to a new video. In this video I want to show you how you can laminate your own photos using this old machine. This is a clothing press which I paid around $40 for because I didn't want to spend thousands of dollars on a professional cold laminating machine. They basically do the exact same thing so let me show you how. The first thing we need is of course a photograph to laminate. And then we need some foam board with adhesive on. You can just peel this off when you have adhesive here. And we will of course need some laminating film. You get this in all kinds of varieties uh, with coarse texture or fine texture or no texture at all, just glossy. I like this one because this has a fine but not too coarse texture. So let me show you how it's done. I am going to laminate these two photos. The first thing I want to do is to attach them to the foam board like this. So I'll just peel off this. So now I'm just gonna lay this down on the adhesive on the foam board like this. And just find something to roll with so you can use anything. Make sure you have some space here because this is the place where we are going to attach the laminate film. Now I have cut out a sheet with the laminating film, uh, oversized. It's very important that you have this area here because you're going to attach the laminating film there. Just peel it off like this. What I'm going to do now is to lay this over like so. Attach it down to the foam board. And I take my fingers from the middle and just, and just make sure it's no bubbles. Now I'm going to turn this around. And you can just attach this to the back side of the board like this. Now make sure you have no dust on your photo. Push this in the press, make a slightly turn just to get it started. And ah, okay. So I'll just take it this way. Put it in press a couple of times. And perfect. If you get small air bubbles, you can pop them with a needle, as long as it's not too big or, or too much, of course. If you need more pressure, you can add a plate on top of this to make it even tighter. The final step is to cut the photos down to size. So that's it, a very affordable way to laminate your photographs. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.